Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. Today we are back and it's been a couple days. I know. I'm really trying to find more time to play the game. There's only a single announcement today, but it's a big one. Yes, yes. It's so wonderful to see all the enthusiasm for island life. Our population is certainly growing, hmm? Stripe is becoming a rather bustling place. Yes, yes. Our goal as always is to provide you all with top quality support you deserve. And so, please note, Resident Services will soon relocate from its current tent into a new, more permanent building. Wow. It's a big move and construction will take some time, so we will be closed tomorrow. Please check on the lost items in the recycle box or use the Nook Stop today while it's available. Yes, yes. Okay, I'll keep it in mind. So yeah, there's a couple things I wanna do. Mabel was there. Um, some of you are saying that I need to buy from Mabel for her to set up a full shop, so I'm gonna keep that in mind. And it's been a couple days since I've played, so there should be, um, Apple should have fully moved in and another villager on top of that should move in as well. Anyways, happy home academy about Zebra's home. 16,390 points, rank B. Congratulations, this time your home scored 10,000 points or more, so we're sending along a commemorative gift. Hope you like it. I love it already, I don't even know what it is. That's how excited I am to see it. So let's take a look right over this way. Open it up, we get a HHA pennant. No, how do I, is it something that I put on the wall? I think so. So let's go inside and figure that out. But yeah, it's been a couple days since I've last played. I'm really excited to play though. So yeah, we'll just get into it. We'll say hi to our new villagers. We'll just sort of see what's going on. So can I just hang on wall? Aha, oh, very fancy. I'll definitely have to organize some things around here, but it's looking pretty good. Okay, heading out of here then. I wanna talk to Tom Nook, I wanna say hi to Mabel. How much money do we have right now? I don't really know. Uh, 20,000 bells on us right now. We have some, I think, in the bank. I don't know how close we are to our next upgrade. Oh, hi, Stu. How you doing, buddy? Ugh, so itchy. Can't not scratch ya. <laughs> What's wrong? Hey, you have allergies? What's going on? Let's chat. Man, I am so excited. Are you not going to explain the, the itchiness? Oh, he has fleas on him. The poor guy. I'm so excited for Buddy Day. Eek, itchy. Hey, ever wonder why you find more wood eggs hitting coconut trees than any other kind of tree? I didn't know that. I'll have to keep that in mind. Coconut trees don't hatch from eggs. Do they? None of them do. Uh, can I help you with that? Can I like hit you with a net? No, a net. Not with that. Please don't hit him with that. Did I get it? No, I'm trying to. What's going on? What's the latest? Whoa, are you wearing a Misty tee? Yes, I am. You're so fancy. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. I couldn't be that fancy. It looks exhausting. Here, hold on. Oh, I got it! Nice! Yes, I caught a flea. The curse is lifted. You're welcome. You saved me from a flea? I guess you could say it was the fleeced you can do. I guess so. Thank you so much for the humor. There we go, we also get a butterfly. I saw this before, I just wanted to make the most of it. Uh, with, with Stu first. Uh, so what's going on? No, 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 not this. Uh, with our nook points going on here. Uh, looks like flea flicker. Itchy fleas are a real hassle. If you see an island buddy struggling with fleas, by all means, help them out. Not only is it a nice thing to do, but you'll get some miles for doing a good deed. So we get one there. That will be 300 miles for us. We're stacking them up now, pretty cool. Anything else going on here? No, so let's uh, see what our daily doubles are. Um, we have the capture memory, we can do that. Talk to your neighbors, two more. Uh, sell fruit, we can definitely do customize items and tend to flowers. Some of those are really easy, some of those might take a second. Uh, taking a picture is as easy as this. Capture taken. Thank you very much. I hear something in the air too. I'm guessing we're gonna be finding all sorts of different eggs in today's episode. I'll be just trying to do what I can with that. Looks like we also have to catch five fish. So where is, trying to listen out for it. Hmm. Also our cherries regrew, that's awesome. I don't see, okay now I hear it. It's gotta be around here somewhere then. Sounds like it's to the right. Aha, okay it's trying to get away from me right now. You get back here. Oh, I'm actually a little too far. Perfect. So this is probably either an egg or a present with an egg recipe in it. Indeed, the bunny day lamp. There was a lot more bunny day stuff than I was expecting, which has me a bit worried that I'm going to run out of time to get everything, but I'll certainly just try my best. We'll also try to get as much fruit as possible because I can sell some of those. Yeah, we have to find our villager friends, start talking to them and see what, what ends up going on here. 
Go ahead and shake that up a little bit. I definitely need to have a day where I just run through and collect as many weeds as possible as well. The to-do list is ever growing in this game. Wow, those oranges bounced around a lot. I guess they can't land on a spot that has a weed. And let's also catch this locust, the long locust, if I can. No, wrong button. What's going on? There we go. Where'd he go now? There he is. Oh, I missed. Okay, I got him. Not bad. I got a long locust. I also have a piece of wood back here. Might as well grab that. So what is our, ooh, this is a full Nook Miles thing, not a plus. You got the bugs, that was our 100th bug caught. Awesome, 500 more miles. Uh, we are going to jump over to the other side now, because I think this is where some of our neighbors are. So this was Apple's house. Unfortunately, we don't have any apples to give her, hopefully at some point. Another thing I have to do, probably not in today's episode, I'll probably make its own episode of it, but I wanna get a Harv's Island. That'll be fun as well. We still have to talk to Mabel. There's so many things we gotta do. But for right now, Apple's in our home. We didn't see it before, it was still all in boxes. So, oh my gosh, it's wonderful. And you're working right now, but I love what you've done at the place. Awesome wallpaper, really cool bunk bed kind of thing. Huh? Oh, were you talking to me? Sorry, I was way in the DIY zone, cheekers. What you up to? <clears throat> well, I'm making a windflower crown. I dreamt the idea when I fell asleep watching Mag Loves in Love. It's about trains in love. One of them, hang on, not important. It doesn't matter if Maglev Mike took their relationship off the rails because I'm building a thing. Hey Zebra, do you wanna know how to make a windflower crown too? Yes, please. I'm going to be the first pop star slash fashion designer slash DIY guru. So I write down all my recipes, here you go. Well, it seems like you got a lot on your plate right now. Oh my gosh, cheekers, it's so way easy. You'll slap one together in no time, Zebra. So it's some kind of crown. Hi, hi you, what's up, cheekers? What's up? So, Wilbur gave me some super, who's Wilbur? I don't know, a super weird intel that I promised to keep to myself, but I can't do it. I'm totes going to explode if I don't tell someone, and that someone is you. Here goes, Wilbur says a certain someone used a Nook Miles ticket to go on an island tour. tour. And while they were there, they hit a rock, and that that's when an egg popped out of the rock. Totes weird, right? Even weirder, I hear eggs are sometimes popping out of rocks on this island too. I'd go check it out myself, but I've got some vocal warm-ups to do. But you could, should def go see if this whole getting eggs from rocks thing is, is for real. Let me know what you find out. I promise I won't tell anyone, Teekers. I already have gotten quite a few rocks. I love her little bunk bed thing. Can you climb up it? You can't. Oh well. Oh, she has a little vacuum too. I'm just gonna turn it on and leave. All right, well that's awesome. We got to meet uh, Apple there. And that means we just need to see one more villager before we're good. We also need to shake all these eggs off the trees. Yeah, we wanna collect as many eggs as possible because we're gonna be using all those for building. It'll be nice. And more oranges for the uh, Nook Miles. So the other two buildings should be right down this way. But while I can, just taking my time getting oranges and stuff. Yeah, I'm glad to see that Mabel's back. I can't wait to buy more clothes from her. I'm gonna try to buy a lot of them. Ooh, some of these definitely have to be eggs. I can only imagine. So let's dig this one up. Yep, there's our first egg. Look, I got, I dug up an earth egg. Good for you. Oh, okay. I was gonna get the dragonfly, but he's turning around. And there's another egg. Okay, did what we could. Moving into here, uh, Celia. So Celia's here, who's Wilbur then? Is Wilbur the, the dodo? I can't remember. There's too many characters now. So let's hit this, oh no! Did the little pill bug is squished? No he didn't, okay he's fine. <laughs> Got a little worried there. So before I grab any of this, I'll try to grab that pill bug as well. Whoop, oh there's a couple dragonflies. I hope that they're expensive. I'd imagine they are, but who knows. Um, nope, didn't mean to chat. Here you are, here you are. Ah, I missed. Oh, that's cool, you can like slide into it. That's so awesome. All right, well there we go, Darner Dragonfly. And a DIY uh, message in a bottle. Come on, I'm missing like crazy. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> you got nowhere to go. I mean, he could just fly away in any direction, but really, I had nowhere to go. So back to it, there's another butterfly. There's so much to do right now. I don't need the common butterfly, the yellow butterfly. Just gonna keep moving. Got all of this. 
How am I doing with fruit? I have plenty of fruit. That definitely is enough to meet the challenge requirement. So we're gonna leave the recipe. Stu is out as well. Cecilia and Stu are out there somewhere. We're gonna find them and say hello. Well, I mean, we already talked to Stu, but Cecilia now will be very exciting. I do need to uh, figure all of this out. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Oh, whoa, what is this? Is that a golden nugget? Huh, I've not seen that before. I guess I should have assumed that if there's an iron nugget, there should be a gold one. Oh, it looks like we got a DIY recipe for this. Oh, hey, it's you again. Hey, Zebra. Hey, Zebra. I only, always, I only always get lost half the time I leave my house now. The other half of the time, I get lost most of the time. And I've remembered most of the names of folks. Now I just have to learn which names goes with to, goes to who. I'm the same way. So um, I brought a present for you today. This makes us officially licensed friends now. Nice. Thank you for the present. I appreciate it. A garden bench. It made. I made it back on my last island. It's the best one I've ever made. No sharp edges. No bad smells. And weighs what it's supposed to. You're the, you're the best. <laughs> We're gonna be the bestest friends that ever friended. I wish I had something for you, I mean, I might. Mm, what's going on? What's the latest? Yeah, bunny day is almost here, and that means eggs are gonna be in all kinds of weird places, like in rocks. I was running and I bumped into a rock and a stone egg just popped out, isn't that cool? Then I talked to Wilbur who said eggs were coming out of the rocks like crazy on the Nook Miles Ticket Islands. I love bunny day. So yeah, Wilbur must be the Dodo. I'm just forgetting his name. <laughs> Sorry, Wilbur. Don't try to do that, it just happens. Yeah, I'm glad he gave us a nice little garden bench there. We'll have to put it out somewhere. And let's also do a bit of this. It's another egg. Okay, so let's put that away. I'm supposed to kick it, gotta keep that in mind. But just because we have new villagers doesn't mean we shouldn't you know, say hello to our older ones. We still have a Biff and Pashmina to say hello to. Go ahead and get a sky egg as well. There's so much to do, because I think there's two more diggable spots here, right? Oh no, this is a rock, but then there was a diggable spot to our left. Oh, it's a coin rock. This one doesn't always give me coins though. But it does right now, so that's good. Awesome, so that is, cause that's 4,000 bells? Okay, it's like a different amount every time. Oh, there's a present over there. And you guys also let me know, you've been letting me know a ton of useful information recently, uh, that the colors of the balloons mean different things. What color means what, I have already forgotten but I'll try to learn about it a bit more right here. Oh, is it like right over the river? I can't get that, not until it gets over there. That's sort of a shame. Unless maybe I could get it from this angle? I don't think so though. Oh, I can. No! My present! Oh, that stings. Lost treasure, oh my, you popped the balloon with a skillful shot, but the attached prize fell into the water. Maybe some Nook Miles will help you recover from that sunken feeling, hmm? That's the worst! I missed out on a present. Oh well, it happens. Live and learn. You know, we'll do it once so that we never have to do it again, hopefully. I will probably make the mistake at some point or another. I do wanna get these cherries. I shouldn't sell them, but my pockets are full actually, so let's just drop those. So I got a couple of things to do then. <laughs> my pockets are full, so is my mind. My mind is full of different things we gotta do. Uh, we got a message in a bottle here. Yay, you found it! I thought of this DIY recipe while I was letting loose during dance practice. I put it in this bottle, so def check it out. My Just def check out my masterpiece. Uh, show it off once you're done. Bon Bon Master Crafter. So this is a wooden stool DIY recipe. Huh, okay. I do think I need to donate the flea, so we'll do that in just a moment after I check out. What's in here? Maybe actually a fossil this time, and nope, it's an egg. One of these will be a fossil though. But for right now, you know, it's like one less little hole in the ground we have to deal with, so that's still good. So are there rock eggs and earth, earth eggs? I have to check that out. But anyways, Blathers, I don't have much for you. I have one single flea, but I wanna make sure I donate it. Right over this way, this tiny little thing. Got it. Here you go. Here you go, flea, what a wretched thing. Yep, I would love to hear more about fleas. Ah, I see. In that case, 
Allow me to be blunt. The flea is foul. It is also disgusting, repugnant, and vile. Whew. But I digress. This horrid pest sucks the blood of humans and animals. In fact, it is the flea's own saliva that makes us itch. And did you know their legs are so strong they can jump more than 50 times their body length? So you see, it's all too easy for a flea to jump from you to me. I itch the very thought. Anywho, uh, my sincere thanks for your donation. Well, luckily it's contained in that case, so don't open it up. Uh, so we are going to be done with that. I'm glad we have one little tiny addition to our wonderful museum. We'll keep working on it throughout today's episode if we find new stuff. I haven't found too many new things in terms of it being a new season. Um, hoping that changes. So for right now, we gotta go to uh, Timmy and Tommy, sell a couple of things. I was thinking like I gotta go to uh, Nook's tent, but that's not quite right anymore. So we'll see what they have to offer. Very excited about this. Then we gotta talk to uh, Mabel. Wow. Hello, hello, welcome to Nook's Crowny. I have things to sell, first and foremost. Uh, I wanna sell. So I am offering right now a pill bug, not that, a uh, long locust, fruit, uh, sure, the clumps of weeds, common blue bottle, two darner dragonflies, and that's actually it. Look at all the fine things you've brought in today. Allow me just a moment to run the numbers, and done. 2,280 bells, not too much, but I'll make the most of it. And what about this? It's a little tiger. Seems like you're interested in the paper tiger. Is it paper? Doesn't look like it. it looks like it's like porcelain or something. 1,500 bells, I'll pass, but very cool. I just wanna see everything they have to offer today. They also have this nice little mirror, a desk mirror. So I could have that instead of my mirror, but I think I like the one I have. Over this way, I wouldn't mind getting something like this for like some kind of campsite area. Seems like you're interested in the campfire cookware. How much is it? 900, actually that's quite cheap, I'll buy it. Uh, Cause I'm sure we get like Nook Miles for buying stuff eventually. And this is just like a simple little like desk chair, school chair. Uh, Don't think I need it, but very interesting. I'll take a pass on it. And then what do you have in terms of wallpaper and stuff? Here's about what's in the cabinet, here's what we have today. Uh, so nothing too major here, of course. What are these very wildest dreams, DIY testers, DIY skills? These are very expensive, I don't know what these are. Well, I think I might have gotten this tester DIY skills, I can't remember. Um, anyways, white subway tile wall, pink flower print wall, I think this is what uh, Apple had. Uh, black crown wall and blue crown wall. Also for the flooring, we get dark herringbone flooring. I actually like that, maybe we could take that one. Uh, leopard print flooring, random square tile flooring, and then finally cool paint flooring. I think I'll do this one. I don't know if I'll use it for my current room, but eventually we'll be upgrading our house and it should have more than one room, so that'll be cool. Thank you, thank you, you're welcome. So I'm out of here for now, but I'm sure I'll be back today. Good to have spent some bells, help out the local economy. And let us do this, sell fruit. Complete DIY projects, we'll do that one at some point. But for right now, anything new on the bulletin? No. Oh, here's Mabel, and here's Pashmina. Let's talk to Pashmina, should also get the other Nook Miles thing done. Sup, kidders, where you headed? Let's talk. Or talk, not past tense, what am I talking about? Uh, this island's got a ton of foods I've never heard of. I'm trying to come up with meals for as many as I can. It'd be cool if cooking was more of a part of this game than it is. Uh, what's bugging you, kidders? Uh, this is yours, I don't know what I'm giving you. What is it, kidders? Uh, let's give her an orange. Now that is a tasty, look, tasty looking oranges. <laughs> Thanks, I could eat these for days. They're scary good, kidders. No problem, do you have anything else to say? Oh, oh kidders, someone's feeling chatty. Came by for a chat. I got a teensy little favor to ask you, Zebra. Ooh, I'm trying to figure out a gardening thing. I need a creepy crawly critter that likes hanging out on flowers. Sure, I could catch on myself, but my critter catching style would be pretty rough on the flowers. I'm on it. For real? That'd be awesome. So I guess we have like a little thing to do for her. It doesn't matter which flower, as long as it, I mean, which type of bug, as long as it's on the flower, I suppose. So when as soon as we see one, there's not one available right now. But as soon as when there, there is one available, we'll do it. So we get 400 miles for this over this way. So that's all for d doubles, right? No, we gotta tend the flowers and then do uh, customized items. So while we're at the flowers and waiting around for them, 
we might as well water them. Actually, I do hear a present somewhere. Where exactly is that? Oh, and there's another diggable spot. There's so much to do. So much to do. I hear it, but I don't see it. Aha, that's actually a fossil this time. What do you know? Hmm. Oh, here it is, here it is. So let's get the slingshot out. Oh no, I missed it. So this one's a rainbow one, so this one will probably have something egg day related in it. Which is cool, but I always like it when it's something unique. Okay. Wow, I'm not doing so good right now. What is going on? There we go. I know it's just a sky egg. Oh, there's a ladybug. Get the ladybug done. I think I've donated a ladybug, right? I don't know. I caught a ladybug. Yeah, okay. If it doesn't say yes at the beginning when you first catch them, that means you've already gotten it. And chances are, that means I've also donated it. So I think we're fine. I'll also dig this up, just another egg. I don't know where Pashmina went, but the next time I see her, uh, oh, here's another DIY recipe. Next time I see Pashmina though, I gotta, where did she go? <laughs> she can't have, can't have gone too far, right? Couldn't have gone too far. She's so sneaky. Oh, here's another one. Okay, that's gonna make its way across the water. Let's not make the same mistake twice. Okay, that still needs a second. And got it. Not bad. So what will this one be? We need to learn a couple of these. So Windflower Crown. Huh, okay, sweet. I learned the DIY recipe for Windflower Crown. Thank you, Apple. And then present, open, Bunny Day Fence. Got it. And then there's still the other one. Uh, well, actually, this might be the gift from Stu. Yep, garden bench. Maybe I wanna put that where we're working on our park. Where did Pashmina go? We'll have to run into her later. Cause I just don't know where she ran off to in that short amount of time. She's quick. She's real quick, wherever she went. Maybe she went back home. I'll check her house real quick. Actually, let's talk to Stu as well. Keep meaning to do that, I keep forgetting. He's, I'm not Stu, Biff. He's not home. Anyways, oh, money tree. There's so many distractions. And then there's two more praying mantis uh, things. So I could definitely try to grab some of those. Ready? As soon as it poses like that, I think that means we're close enough to grab it. All right, I called an orchid mantis. And, oh, I shouldn't have ran like that. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. She must have gone back home. No. Where is she? She's sneaky. Here she is, she's on the beach, looking at her phone. Oh, I wanna talk to you. It won't let me. Hey. You again, is this island not big enough for the both of us? Do we need a bigger island, kidders? I brought you a bug, like you asked. Oh, you brought it? Ah, this is so exciting, kidders. So we'll go ahead and give her the ladybug. I think that one's cheaper. I'll sell the other one. A ladybug, whoa, sweet. Thanks, Zebra, I'm so speed and revved. Up right now, that's a, that's a weird saying, I like it. Oh, you're giving us a shirt, thank you. I know it ain't much in return for what you got me, but I hope you like your striped tank. Ooh, sounds like fun. Uh, and also, we get ourselves Smile Isle. Good deeds are their own rewards, but go ahead and have some Nook Miles too for fulfilling requests from other island residents, yes, yes. So I guess these are really cool little side quests we can do at some point. Well, almost a 10,000 miles, it's pretty major. So where's the shirt at? Striped tank. Pretty cool, I don't think I wanna wear that for right now, but I wanna keep a collection of clothing so we have some stuff to fill up our wardrobe with. And let's talk to you. Hi, Mabel. Good afternoon, Zebra. Thanks for stopping by. How can I help you today? What's on sale? You got it, here's what I'm selling today. I wanna buy as much as I can from you. Hand knit tank, ooh, simple parka sounds fun. Multicolor shorts, bomber style skirt, coveralls with arm co color covers, uh, star hairpin, oval glasses, neon tights, and trekking shoes. I'll try the trekking shoes. 1500 for the trekking shoes, I'll buy. You got it. I really hope she moves in at some point though. <laughs> cause I don't know what day she shows up. Uh, cause I don't know if I can afford buying everything. I mean I could, but is it worth it? I don't know. 
Uh, we'll go buy the parka and maybe the shorts. Got it, okay. And then, finally, I hope we get the customized clothes at some point, that'd be fun. Uh, Multicolor shorts. I don't know if I'll wear these, but I just wanna get some of her wares purchased, just in case that encourages her to get a, a, a shop. Thanks, that's it for right now. But also, I wanna just say hi. Just saying hi. That's so sweet, thanks for coming to say hi, and if there's anything you need, just give me a shout, okay? So I can't like ask her to stay. Be cool if she could be our villager. Uh, so yeah, what else do we have here? We have the simple parka, which doesn't look so bad. We also have, oh yeah, the shoes, which I'm not super wild about, but I think they look better than the shoes we had. And then what is this again? Oh yeah, the weird shorts. I think I'll just keep with something like this. Uh, we will switch over to the slingshot to get that way down that way. Okay, ready? I think there's another one flying around too. So what do we get inside of that one? We'll have to find out in a moment. There definitely is another one around. There it is, get it quick. Yeah, before it fell in the water. Oh no, our slingshot's done for. That's fine, it happens. So yeah, let's take a look. Uh, in this one we get the cassette player. And then where was the other one? Oh, over this way. It took the place of the slingshot. This should be a DIY recipe. Bunny Day Glowy Garland. Don't know what a garland is, but we'll learn how to make one. Whew, so there's still lots to do. I need to talk to Tom Nook. I need to pick up these cherries so that we can make more cherry trees soon. A whole host of things to get done. So first though, before I forget, I should probably just go and buy a new slingshot. So I'll do that really quickly. But yeah, I mean, overall still some pretty good progress is talking to everybody, figuring everything out. I wanna figure out how much more money we still have to go before we get to uh, being able to upgrade our next loan. Cause I think I have some money put away because I really want a bigger house, for sure. See you guys. So I'm back home, I wanted to get some things organized before we go too much crazier because I have a couple of things I could put away, the eggs most importantly. Uh, so, and also the clothes though. The clothes I definitely don't need right now, but mostly eggs and also any kind of material that I've gotten. Uh, like this golden nugget. I can't believe we got that though. How many of the, those will I need to get other things upgraded, I wonder. That might be a lot of work and we'll replace the cherries with the slingshot. I'll have to uh, bury those at some point. Don't need the striped tank. Don't need this wood. I'll keep the fossil. I like this flooring, but I don't know if I want it for this room. I think this is still a good color combo. So for right now, we'll just go ahead and put that in storage as well. The multicolored shorts, get in there. Cassette player, let me place this item. Nice. Oh, we got something done. I guess for decorating our house a bit more. Uh, no, not that. Here we go. Good things in store. I'll reward you with miles based on the number of items you have. So now it got up to 50. Really, we have 50 items in here? That's crazy. But I do think I will take that. Because we have this now. Wait, well, you don't have any songs you can register. What is this about? Oh, uh, yeah, how do I get songs? Hmm, I'm not quite sure. So I guess for right now I'll keep the radio until I get registered songs. Weird. Well, for right now, what we can do is just move that back to where it was. Perfect. And just put everything else away. So the cassette player I will keep, but I don't have any cassettes, I guess, right now. The oranges, I'll put some in there. Uh, stone eggs. Garden bench I wanna put outside. And what was this one? This is the campfire cookware. So we got some stuff we can figure out for sure. For right now though, now we have plenty of room. We can go back to exploring. I wanna to talk to Tom Nook and deposit some of our money away in the bank. Especially since if the tent is gonna be closed tomorrow, I wanna to check out what they have for sure today. Opening this up. But yeah, that's so cool that things are getting upgraded and we don't even have to give them any materials or money for it either. Usually we do. Hey buddy. Ah, Zebra, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. What should I do? Yes, yes, that is the question. 
I can't think of any more advice to give you, Zebra. You've accomplished so much, I'm sure you can find your own ways of having fun and living your best life. I wonder if we've sort of completed everything he'll tell us to do. I don't think so, but maybe. I really don't know how much more the game has to offer us. Like, I, I don't, I've gotten decently far in Animal Crossing games before, but I think I'm sort of reaching as far as I've ever made it. Customizable phone case kit? That sounds like fun. Redeem 1800 miles for this? Yeah. All right, we'll get that at some point. That'll be really cool. Uh, I do wanna make another selection. I don't think anything in here. Oh, I can get more than one? So I can get like multiple phone cases. That's super cool. And there's new fences to buy. We need to buy these every day. Thousand miles for this. The other one looked familiar. I don't know if we've gotten that one before. I don't know if I wanna risk buying the same thing twice. Like what happens when you do that? Nothing? You'd think they would give you like a bigger warning about it. But there's no indication. Well, actually, let me, details. It doesn't say whether I have it or not, which is sort of baloney when you think about it. You already have this recipe. Okay, never mind, never mind. Nope. So it does tell me somewhere. That is appreciated. And then there's a bunch of Tom Nook stuff that I don't exactly need at the moment, but maybe one day, maybe one day. Uh, it, none of it looks bad. <laughs> It is sort of weird to have just all this corporate sponsorship when you have to pay for it. Uh, Nook Shopping. Let's see what special goods he has. Oh wow, he has the Animal Crossing New Horizons Steam Nintendo Switch. I actually have this. It's super cool. And you can get it in the game for a lot of bells. I don't need it though. Uh, we got a drying rack, paisley bandana, sporty shades. Hello, T. Uh, number two shirt, denim pants. I think we should just get some denim pants. I mean, they, they don't look all that different from what we currently have, but we can try it out. Uh, rain boots, stale cupcakes. I need it. <laughs> I don't know why I need it, but I need it. Um, so one last thing, and that is putting away money into the ABD. We have $70,000 put away right now, 70,000 bells. Um, well, actually not paying the loan. Deposit. 20,000, so we will go ahead and donate all this, or not donate, but deposit into the loan once it's at its required amount. But for right now, if it could possibly be earning up interest, we should be doing that instead. And let's see what's inside of here. Oh, we get tatami flooring, frilly pants, record box, we got a lot of stuff. Cardboard box again, and another cardboard box. I guess it's just some people are doing their recycling. Maybe it gets blown away in the wind. Um, so let's, first off, let's take a look at this record box. What is this about? I can't put things in the plaza, sorry. Let's try now. Record box. Oh, interesting, so it, of course, is full of records. I'm not really a big record listener, so I don't know if I'll keep that, but there's also frilly pants. Those are frilly. <laughs> not my style. We'll hold on to them for now, and then we also, I wish I could take a look at it no matter where I was, but. Not really. So we'll put some of this away, some of it I'll definitely sell, and we'll see how that goes. And then I have to go to the north part of the island. I gotta go to the north part, we gotta adventure around for more um, uh, fossils and stuff at the least. Let's try this out, place on floor. Wow, interesting. Um, I don't think I want that at the moment, but I won't decide for myself now. So there's a record box I definitely don't need, so we'll be selling that stuff. But for the other things, I want to set them up near the park or where I plan on setting up. Because I think that, as far as I understand, at some point we're also able to set up a camp from the trailers and stuff, I remember that. So I would like to have like a camp out this way and then also a park where you can visit while you're camping. Like that sounds like a lot of fun. So having a bench, having a nice little campfire area, sounds like all a good idea to me. So here's our little tire. If you don't remember, we were setting up like a little play area here. So garden bench would be perfect for it. Oh yeah, that's like the perfect kind of park bench. I'm not gonna be super specific with it at the moment with its placement. I just sort of want it out here so I know what to do with it later. And same thing with the campfire cookware that we bought earlier in today's episode. This will be sort of the camping area. We also got country fence, gotta learn that. We bought that from the Nook Miles thing. So let's continue with our adventure of trying to find more eggs and also more shovel spots. I'm sure there'll be more around. Got it. Anything else? Oh, here we go, here we go. And also, this rock. I haven't hit this one today. So far, so good. 
Keep at it. But I do hope that I get golden nuggets soon. More of them. Because I don't know when we'll be using those upgrades, but if we could get things even more upgraded than they currently are, because once you use the iron nuggets to upgrade stuff, it lasts a while, so I can only imagine if it gets a bunch better, that'd be awesome. I do hear more stuff coming in from the ocean. Another bunny day thing, and of course it's right over the water again. Can't do much about that for right now. We'll let it just continually fly. Oh, that's a big fish. If it's another egg though, it's probably another egg. That just sort of seems to be what the game likes to do. Whoop. Whoa, immediately. Oh wow, it actually is a fish. Got a black bass. Nothing super interesting, but it's still a fish. Hmm. So taking one last look around this way before we start going up on the higher areas. I've already been sort of around here though today, so I think we're good to go up with the ladder. All right, there's another rock over here, perfect. And I do see over that way there's a diggable spot. So there's a couple of things going on. Oh, and a money tree. See, there's lots of stuff. Also, these eggs out of the rocks are different than the eggs out of the ground. So we'll have to make the most of those. I wonder if we'll have any extra eggs afterwards. If we do, I guess we could sell them. I don't know how much to sell for. You get a lot of them, so I can't imagine they would be very much. But there we go, we duck up a fossil. Oh no, there goes our shovel. I really needed that not to happen, but no. <laughs> I guess you can do that, you can jump over stuff. I need to go and get a new shovel now, so that hopefully, uh, oh, I might need some sticks. So, that might be my best bet for that. Also, if we could be ready for wherever it is. Where is it? Did it fly past me? It did. Oh, what about that butterfly in the back? That might be a new one. I hope so. I can't remember. Gotcha. Oh, yep, he's got another DIY recipe idea. Good job. Where did that butterfly go? Over this way. It makes sense that my shovel finally broke. I've been using it a lot. Do I have this one? Yeah, the Madagascan Sunset Moth. Uh, it's another one to sell then. <laughs> There's so much going on in the game at all times, it's crazy. So what materials do I need to build the shovel? Because it might just be easier than uh, and shopping for it. I just need hardwood, oh okay. I can do that, honestly. While I'm out here, I'll just get a new set of it. One, no! <laughs> Okay, you know what? I was gonna go buy the stuff. It's so much easier to do it that way anyways. Um, oh, but there's another one coming down. Get this, go like that, I missed. Go like this, I missed again. There we go. It's just another egg, but I need them. I really will probably need them. With how many recipes there are, I can only imagine. Uh, so I'm going past the shop right now, because I'm silly. Let's try this again. <laughs> We will sell some stuff, we will buy uh, the replacement tools I need, upgrade them with the iron nuggets, that should be good. Hi there, Timmy and Tommy. Uh, I wanna sell. So I am offering uh, cardboard box, cardboard box, record box, orchid mantis, this fish, and this butterfly. I don't know if that'll be all that much, but 6,000 bells, that's actually pretty good. Jumps us up to 8,800 and 10. And then some tools. So I need a new shovel and a new ax. Yep. Hopefully eventually we can upgrade their shop so that we can buy even higher tier goods. That'd be cool. Because I don't know how upgradable everything is. Is this the best a shop ever gets? Because I know in some of the other Animal Crossing games you can upgrade the shop. I think you'll be able to in this one. Why wouldn't you, you know? Ooh, so much to do, so much to do. This game is very, very much a lot of busy work. Hmm. So we have the iron nuggets and we have stone, so we should be able to make both of them, I think. Let's craft. Uh, so, stone axe. Actually, I do not have enough wood, as per usual. But I have plenty of iron nuggets, so here we go. Shovel, 
All done for now. I'll go and get some wood. I need three more than what I currently have. I don't know if I'm still a little low on that in my inventory compared to when I was, uh, like before I had to build a bunch of stuff for the three houses. So we're gonna find out. We have a lot of dark wood and we only have four normal wood. That's crazy. I really need to work on that. Very busy though. But yeah, I hope you guys have been enjoying this, the game so far. This is the 15th episode, which is pretty crazy. We've been getting through it quite quickly and I still have plenty more to play. So excited for all of it. Let's get back to crafting. I need to make really quickly just a stone ax. Nothing too crazy about it. And then we'll go back up to the upper layers. Got to uh, remake that one thing. Okay, see, so yeah, let's move this stuff so that everything is in its proper place. And perfect. But we want to plant that money tree. We probably want to look for more uh, of the other stuff. More of the diggable spots and, and the such. There's another stink bug. Ah, oh, I scared him off, darn. Anything going on in this way? Not looking like it. So here's the money tree area. Switch over to that. And then I just gotta dig this up real quick. Because we always make our money back from it. In the long run, you just gotta be a bit patient. Apparently you guys have been saying that you can put even more money in the hole and get even more money out of it. We gotta do that at some point, but maybe at a time when I'm willing to risk more money. Because I know I'm probably gonna forget about it anyways and just leave it there for way too much time. Okay, there's another diggable spot. I don't see any rocks around. Boom, got it. So that's our like fourth or fifth fossil. So chances are that's all I need. But I wanna make extra sure of that. So we're gonna go up here. And it already looks like uh, there's nothing up here. Wrong thing. It'd be cool if I could use that, that pole to just get up this way, but not so much. Hmm. Yep, okay, we're good then. So I'm going to skedaddle for now. We'll get all of our fossils assessed and that should be great. Oh no, oh no, can I do it in time? Can I do it in time? Oh, no, really? Wait, one more time, there it is. Okay, we saved the egg. The sky egg will not become a water egg. That was scary. Wait, is there something? No, that's a chip in the wood. I thought there was a green bug on there. Okay, we're good. Let's go into here and see what we can end up getting out of our donated fossils. Will these all be new ones? Will they be some repeats maybe? Probably. So, Blathers, help me out with this one, buddy. Uh, assess fossils. One, two, three, four, five of them. That's awesome. Being able to find one in, a five in one day like that is pretty cool. So, are they all not part of our collection? That's cool. Because every time we find a unique one, that means if we find it in the future, we can just sell it and make some major money. Well, actually, no, only one of them. <laughs> An Australopith. Interesting. Well, here's your Australopith. Ooh, who could it be? It is an Australopith. I've never laid, I, I never thought I'd laid eyes on such a pun, a pun. Okay, whatever. I can't read correctly today, I'm sorry. Please tell me more. Wonderful, it is fascinating stuff, I assure you. The Australopith, thought to be one of the links between humans and apes, emerged four million years ago. They lived long ago, even before the ancestors of the modern humans, so there are profound differences. Even so, it seems to me that you can see the beginnings of greatness here. And there you have it, fascinating stuff now, very interesting. So, that's awesome. I gotta go and sell these other ones for sure. Hopefully make some good cash out of it, because some of these fossils I can only imagine. Like if we get like a T-Rex skull, that has to sell for a lot, right? Anyways, we're heading back out for right now. I also still haven't met Celia. Apparently she's about and about somewhere. I haven't seen her. That's fine. We'll like we'll see her eventually. Hey guys, I am going to sell you some stuff. I hope you're interested. Uh, I want to sell. So I am offering a T-Rex skull. I was 
Wow, what is it? What are the odds? How much does the T-Rex skull, skull sell for? Six thousand? I thought it was gonna be like like fifty thousand. Oh well, I w I would pay a lot for that. Seems very cool to me. Um. Anyways, so that's how much the T-Rex skull sells for. I feel like fossils used to sell for more in the previous games. We get the right Terra wing, Parasaur tail, and a right Terra wing. So really, we got two right Terra wings here. Weird. Anything else I want to sell? Not looking like it. Everything else is just materials I'll be putting into storage. 11,500 pals, so about uh, 5,500 for each of them, around there, something like that. Uh, not too bad. It's a good jump in cash for sure. So with that, that's most of what I wanted done for today's episode. I think if I want to spend any more time on anything today, it will be fishing. So first, I'm going to put away everything I have right here, and then we'll get the fishing. So we have a nice and open inventory, and I wanna spend the rest of today's episode filling it up with fish, if we can. Or at least until my fishing rod breaks. If I catch one fish though, and then it breaks, I'm gonna, I'll go ahead and replace it, but. I just feel like I haven't been fishing as much recently. It's my favorite thing to do in this game. Uh, maybe I'll grab a couple of shells as well. I don't wanna grab too many of those. They just stack up, so they're a good thing to sort of earn up the sell. But if we could catch a couple of new fish, because I really don't think we've caught a single new fish since April began, and that bones me out. That was what I was really excited for, is to see what new fish were available. And bugs and stuff, we found like one or two new bugs. I mean, we just found a flea at the beginning of today's episode. It's not particularly interestingly new, but it is new, and it's an egg. That's sort of been the, tr the trouble though. A lot of the time you think you're getting an egg, or a fish, and you get an egg, and that's sort of a little bit discouraging, because it takes so much more time to fish than it does to say hit a rock or hit a tree. When you get an egg for that, it's like not as big of a deal. Okay, here we go, this is an all flounder, right? No, it's a dab, I always get the two mixed up. All flounders are significantly bigger, it seems. At least in the game, I don't know about in real life. Not much of a fish knowledgeable person. I'll have to learn more about fish to be able to comment on that. Oh, here's a present, oh, and this one's not a multicolored balloon, which means that I should be able to get something that isn't an egg recipe out of it. I think I hear one to the right as well, but I'm not entirely sure. So let's see what this blue balloon has for us. It has iron nuggets. So I guess blue maybe means materials. Interesting. Have to keep that in mind. Iron nuggets are really useful to have. It could be a pain to get something, even as little as five iron nuggets. So happy to get that. Now let's get this fish. Come on, buddy. Please don't be an egg. Gotcha. It's an egg. <laughs> maybe this is why I haven't been fishing very much. But maybe they're like more common in the ocean than they are the river. So we'll, we'll keep ocean fishing for now, but if I keep getting eggs, maybe we will get something or we'll go somewhere else instead. Come on. Nice. It's another egg. Wow. Very surprising. I guess I'll catch some of these guys because they're not out too often. Got one. <laughs> Wish you could catch more than one at once, but we get a wharf roach. I know Biff was asking for one of those at some point. I haven't seen Biff yet today. There's a lot of people who apparently are here, but they're just too out and about for me to find them. And I never go back this way too often, but as you can see, there's not often things for us. Okay, you know what I'll do? I'll use the ladder. We'll get up this way and we'll start river fishing. There's also a pond. Whoa, that's a new butterfly. Where are you going? No, come back, come back, come back. I can't catch you if you're way out there. Okay, it's circling around. Got it! Wow, so what is this? No, we have gotten an agrius butterfly. Never mind, I'm wrong. <laughs> well, one more to sell, but we do have, as you can see now, this. And as you can see also, it's taking me a while to catch five fish because none of them are fish. And I also have to chop down a tree. Let's do that real quick. One, two, and three. I might just leave these, pick them up later. Because right now I just want to get stuff that I can sell off right away. Because they're not going to go anywhere if I leave them here. Sell shells. Well, I've picked up a couple of shells. I'll try to pick up a couple more. Oh, sorry, I scared away the bug. So there's a fish. Let's get you. Now this one's way smaller than the ones that are normally eggs. So my hope is high that it's not a small egg. 
What's it gonna be? Oh wow, you're new. A bluegill. Well, no, we've gotten a bluegill before. Thought I was getting a new fish. Nope, that's fine. A fish is still a fish, happy about that. I know this is gonna scare off that locust up there, but I gotta get up here one way or another. Now this guy may just be another egg, but he also may not be. Got his attention. It disturbs me how sentient the, the, the eggs seem when they're swimming around like fish. Oh no. Uh, here we go again. I need to catch two more real, actual fish soon. Let's go down this way. Whoop. And down here as well. Oh, a couple more shells. Definitely wanna grab those if we're trying to sell those. We gotta have them first. I wonder if the manila clams count. Probably not, because they're so common. They're always like spurting out of the water like that or the, or the sand. Not seeing too many fish at the moment though. Oh, here we go. And once again, it's small, so it shouldn't be an egg. The paying attention to the size seems to really help right now. Come on now. Oh, right away. Oh, what are you? You're not an anchovy, are you? That's new. It is an anchovy. Stay away from my pizza. <laughs> Unless you like that on your pizza, but I don't. So. It's staying away from my pizza specifically. Oh, no, wrong button. Let's keep picking some of this up. Nothing out this way, okay. So pretty cool we got one new fish. It's the anchovy, this is definitely an egg. I can just see, you have egg written all over you. But we gotta get you. That's a little too far away. Come on, here it is, here it is. Boop. Come on. Nice. Whoa, <laughs> we got something, it's a red snapper. We already have one of you, but it's good to have another. So there's our five fish caught at the least. Very nice to see it. Uh, we'll definitely be selling 10 of those. Uh, 20 clumps of weeds. We can actually build that up pretty quickly. Oh, we got a uh, bunny day DIY thing. Uh, boingity boing, and congrats to you. You just got yourself an egg recipe. Can you hear the applause? Could there be others out there? Open your peepers and look about. The answer is yours to find. Yours truly, the lucky bunny. All right, well, this is the bunny day table. I wonder if, I, I definitely will have to find a checklist to see if there's like, you know, if I've gotten everything. Because I want to make sure that I do. All right, will this little fish be interested? Seems like he is. Oh. It's a little yellow perch. Horse mackerel, they're very similar, but I think yellow perch is maybe actually a uh, a river fish. So as we're traveling along the river, I will catch whatever river fish pop up and collect some, uh, some weeds. Come on now. A little bit more. Gotcha. Okay, so another uh, bluegill. Got a good couple more of these to pick up. No, 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 I didn't mean to steal your table. I didn't even realize I could do that. I could like steal and sell your table. It's it's not yours anymore, I guess. Hold on, there we go. Don't mean to mess up your, your yard though. That's rude to me. Okay, so over this way, what do we got going on? First off, a good chunk of weeds. Oh, here we go, here's a little fish. Come on now. Ooh. Nice. And as you can see, we get a bluegill. So we have enough room for two more fish. So we'll keep looking for them. Go up the river a little bit. Shouldn't it be that big of a deal? I do hear something flying though. What is it gonna be whenever I find it? See, sometimes you can lower the camera, sometimes you can't. Is it over the water again? 
It will be, if I'm not careful. It always shows up around here for some reason. Got it. It's another egg. This is gonna be another egg. But I might as well try for it. Come here. Actually, it might be a little bit bigger. I hope. Could be a black bass. Come on. Oh, yep, black bass. It's fine. That means I have room for how many more? One more, right? Nope, that's it, because the sky egg. Great. <laughs> so we're gonna go and sell all this to Timmy and Tommy, and then we'll be all right for today's episode. Been a lot of fun, just sort of expanding things. Exciting to know that the next day, whenever that is, I might record one more episode today. But then after that, the next in-game day and real life day, there should be a new thing set up. That'll be cool. Or at least it'll be beginning, it's setting up. So I wanna sell. Of course, what exactly are you offering? I am offering a black bass, two, or actually three bluegills, these weeds, this stuff, not the anchovy, not the anchovy, sorry, I'm hiccuping. Uh, there we go. That should be a lot of money. 13,160 bells sold. And now we'll donate the, the uh, anchovy real quick and then everything will be perfect. So we got a couple of things donated. We got a good chunk of money. We got to buy some stuff from Mabel. Hopefully that encourages her to move to this island at some point. You know, set up a little establishment. That'd be great. Hi, Blathers. I got an anchovy for you. I wish I could give it to you without you waking up, but it doesn't really work that way. So I think that's the only thing we have at the moment. But hey, it's one more thing, right? Anchovy. Here you go. So I think that's three things donated in today's episode. The flea, the anchovy, and a uh, fossil of some sort. Uh, wonderful, I would love nothing more. There are more than 140 species of anchovy, but they do all have some things in common. They are all small and feed by simply swimming with their mouths open to filter food particles from the sea. In my sleepier moments, I sometimes wish I could do that. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Okay, well very, very cool. Hope you enjoy that anchovy. And that's it. So there we go, lots of fun. We got to meet uh, Apple as well. Very cool to get an additional villager to our town. So we'll have to meet Silly at some point. Next episode, I wanna go to that, what was his name, Harvey? I wanna go to his island, that would be fun. But for right now, I'm just going to go ahead and take these two things, 200 there, 100 here. And with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.